build a multi-million dollar enterprise for the kingdom of God. This is business architecture for kingdom ambassadors. Achieve multi-millionaire status with three habits. This is a very special time in the history of mankind. We are experiencing things our ancestors couldn't even imagine. The wealth of knowledge created by man is available to almost everybody. Shortly it will be available to all humans on the planet. Diamandis and Kotler remind us that the possibility of abundance and positive growth seems impossible to the majority of us. But if we take a look at what is actually happening in the world, we'll see something different. For example, today, even the poorest Americans have access to a telephone, television, and a flush toilet. These are luxuries even the wealthiest didn't have in the last century. Researchers reveal that ignorance about what's really happening is caused by personal bias, outdated facts being taught in school, news bias and intuition, the illusion of confidence. We can handle this by erring on the side of positivity concerning the progress of the human race, then searching for the truth about world affairs. We really are improving in technological advances coupled with individuals desiring prosperity and having access to resources for advancement will speed things up. We are kingdom warriors and ambassadors. It is our responsibility to get wealth. 1. Destroy any fear of success. We are about to see the global emergence of kingdom businessmen and women who will become end-time kingdom wealth masters Dr. Francis Miles. It's amazing, but most of us actually fear being successful. We just can't see ourselves as successful multimillionaires. The fact is, we don't really have many role models to emulate, so we cannot perceive what being wealthy is like, except what we see in the movies and on TV. None of us will get hurt by becoming wealthy. Therefore, we need to get rid of any fear of getting rich. People who enjoy wealth are the ones bold enough to believe they deserve to be wealthy. According to David O. Until you believe that the world will be a better place if you are rich, your efforts towards getting rich will keep getting botched. You have to believe. Not just know it, but be ruled by it. David O. reveals that most of us are thinking only about ourselves and that blocks our thinking about wealth. Being super rich is looking away from yourself and your needs. The ultimate way to become wealthy is to think of the many needs of others, and our culture is in need of an abundance of products and services. The only way you will be able to see some of the good things you want to see in the world is to provide the funding for it. What do you wish you could provide for others? 2. Love learning. As individuals, we must begin our re-education immediately. Chika Anyayani. Continuous learning is an ever-present requirement in today's environment. If you have a cell phone, you know what I mean. A new phone or an update can put you in the learning mode right away. So, we must face it, things are changing so rapidly that we are forced into learning something new almost every day, whether we want to or not. The best way to handle this volatile existence is to just go ahead and develop a love for learning. Such wonderful things are waiting to be discovered. Mike Myatt described the current force driving achievement as a leadership pursuit. As a multimillionaire, you will definitely be a leader, but, what kind of leader? According to Myatt, pursuit of excellence, of elegance, of truth, of what's next, of what if, of change, of value, of results, of relationships, of service, of knowledge, and of something bigger than yourself, is the leadership style required. Having a mindset focused on pursuit is so critical to leadership that lacking this one quality can sentence you to mediocrity or even obsolescence. No one has a magic formula for success. You must make room for new information to enter your mind on a continuous basis. The information that you obtain will put you on the road to wealth. The behaviors and attitudes required of a millionaire will come to you through fresh information. A different way of being will be learned. You will become, through process, a multimillionaire. 3. Practice fast implementation. What is the essence of education if you cannot practice what you have learned? Chika Oyeni. You've heard the phrase, just do it. The idea here is to immediately act on new and relevant information. New information passes out of our minds quickly. Therefore, the best thing to do is to go ahead and do what the new learning suggests. This is just a habit of putting new knowledge to work as soon as you acquire and understand it. Don't worry about the outcome, just go ahead and try it. David O tells us, the moment you get an idea, do something about it immediately. Talk to someone about it. Make an inquiry about it. Send an email, walk into a store, do something about it now. The more you do this, the more it becomes natural for you to do it. And it gradually grows into a habit. That habit can lead you into wealth. Timing is very important when you are building wealth. Fast implementation will help you with being at the right place at the right time. Get to multimillionaire status by destroying any fear of success, love learning and act quickly on new information. 
This is business architecture for kingdom ambassadors. Influence the seven mountains of power with your kingdom-based enterprise. Build a multi-million dollar enterprise for the kingdom of God with superior skills. Visit www.geniuscorytraining.com for online training.